whenever I saw her, I was like, you are the definition of, like, swag. You guys are doing songs that make you dance. What does that sound like to you? I remember, like, being in the eighth grade, and we had, like, the school dance. I wore this little pink dress, and I just watched my school crush dance with the popular girl. Oh. And I broke my heart. From that moment, I was just like, I don't really want to dance anymore. And I bet your school crush was wishing that he would have. He actually asked me out a little bit later. He always yeah. come back around. <laughs> but anyways, okay, so. The song I chose is Shut Up and Dance. Oh, don't you dare look. I'm definitely going to change up the arrangement. I know it's not dancey dancey, but I mean, who says you can't have a little bit of slow dance? Would it feel weird to you if you played on the piano and then you got the mic and got up? That's kind of what I wanted to do. Yeah, you what should do it. <laughs> okay, so. I would pick up the tempo at the end. Yes. Right? Oh. The ultimate goal is just to find a way to keep that energy up because the song is slower. You want people to feel the energy. This is your moment to like get up out of your head. And this song is joyful. Oh. I'm grateful for my time with Sierra. You have everything it takes to come out here and own this thing. This performance is closure for little Emmy. I don't have to dance with that boy. I can dance with myself.